Hello class, I want to make a brief video where you can find some really great information for your um, marketing plan. So go ahead and go to our main website and then go to the library site. Over here where my mouse is moving, you'll see databases and go ahead and select business. You can see we have a bunch of different databases here, but this first one, business searching interface, if you read into it, it has SWOT analyses already done, trade publications, industry profiles, company profiles. This is going to be a great one for you. There's some other really good ones in here as well. Nexus Uni, uh, there's regional business uh, news, some really good, good stuff there. But let's try business searching interface. And what we want is a lot of students want this for their um, for the current situation analysis. They want to know like what's the industry like. So you click over here to industry profiles. You could search by industry and uh, let's just say, for example, you're in the food industry, you could search food and uh, food services and drinking. That's going to be your restaurants and things like that. You have food and beverage stores, uh, gas stations, uh, many, but let's just take food services and drinking. Uh, you have the restaurant industry, hotel industry, food retail. There might be one for fast food. But food retail is probably a good one for those doing fast food. Let's go ahead and do a, there's a PDF and an HTML, but let's go ahead and just, I'm just going to open that, or I guess I can't open it in a new tab. Click there. By the way, I'm logged in right now as a student. You might have to log in here and use your W number and your class web pin number to get into this information. So here we have our food industry. And... It looks like there's a bunch of different issues. It looks like 20, there's a couple, February was the most recent one. Food and grocery. Let's see what else we have here. 2018, November. Food retail. This is a different one. Let's try this. Let's go ahead and open up the PDF. And uh, food and grocery. Um, in 2022, the United States food and grocery retail market is forecasted to have a value of one point, almost, almost a trillion, one, or it is one trillion, 418 billion increase of 16.8%. Competition between players is fierce due to the limited level of product differentiation and consumers, uh, negligible switching costs combined with a challenging and volatile market environment. That'd be a great quote to include in your SWOT analysis. And look at this, they tell you the market value geographic segmentation, market overview. And so you should just be, yeah, you can even these, these table of contents are actually interactive. So if I wanna know um, what uh, buy, the threats of substitution are, or what are the leading companies? So Costco, so this is more for uh, restaurants or for uh, grocery. The next one is Kroger, I'm sure Safeway's in here. What are, it tells you back at the index here. Uh, Kroger, Costco, Target, and Walmart are the big players right now. So that's really good information. Now, someone asked for fast food, so let's go ahead and um, just do a new, you know, fast food USA. Because this is world, you can get things all over at the time. So Barnes Report for fast food restaurant industry, perfect. So here you go. PDF and uh, the 2021 industry and market report for fast food. So um, look at this estimated industry uh, sales, um, many things. So it does uh, market segmentation, sales forecasting, advertising strategies, competitive analysis. So you will want to have a look in here. Um, here's just some of the sub industries. And you can you can see you know what does the growth of the industry look like? If the database doesn't work, you can also find the fast food industry report. Just type it in Google. And I have to say, like this franchise help here is actually reading through this. There's some really good information here, which you know very summarizes some really good information that you can use in your marketing plan, um, especially if you're doing fast food. So depending on your industry, you should be able to also Google. With Google though, just be careful because any kind of non, anything that's not, doesn't have any kind of backing 
you know, it's not, uh, if it's a news article, for example, make sure it is coming from a trusted news source or a trusted website. There's some things out there that, you know, are not uh, trustworthy. So just make sure you're signing your source. And if you ever have any questions, feel free to send me the source and I can tell you whether or not it's acceptable or not.